Hello, all my YouTubers. I am back. I just got fresh enough. I have a little scarf on that my mother in law gave me. Hopefully, you guys like it. They're like little fishies. It smells so good. And so, I'm just stopping by because uh, yesterday I wanted to make uh, a video and of my happy mail but i wasn't able to do a video of my happy mail because i don't know what happened with me yesterday i was sleepy all day i don't know if like the trip from the doctor took a toll on me and i haven't been able to sleep well at night because of the pain and all that stuff but all i know it was just like sleeping beauty all day yesterday to the whole night until I got up early today around 8 o'clock in the morning and something like that right now my husband is getting something together for me I am super hungry there's one thing that despite of the pain and the surgery and all uh, despite, excuse me despite of the surgery and the pain and all that stuff that is going on in my life right now I'm hungry and it's a good sign it's a good sign because they actually want me to eat well and eat everything because they now heal faster and all that kind of stuff uh, based on what my nutritionist says so she even recommend me some drinks and stuff like that I'm not able to get a hold of it because I can't get up from my recliner unless I get help but probably in the next video I'll show you guys um, so I also wait until my medicine kicks in and, and that way I'm able to uh, make the videos. So I do have mail here from my beautiful friend and subscriber Sandra. She sent me uh, a letter and I was kind of reading uh, over it. So I'm going to show you this beautiful letter look at the washi look at the sticker this is my PO box and little stamps I did open it and kind of crushed the back of it but she put some beautiful flowers in the back and I know I, I mean maybe I should have just used a scissors and cut to the side but I didn't have the scissors close by to do that so I have to kind of open it I also received a, a letter from my beautiful wonderful friend uh, APG Jamie I already opened both of these letters and I was reading before I started my video just in case just to see and prepare myself um, I do have another friend that uh, said that she will write to me and so I'll make a video the next time now I don't know which one I should read first. This beautiful look how beautiful that is. Oh my god, thank you, Sandra. You took the time to paint and color this for me. I appreciate it so much. Sandra, I appreciate your friendship. I don't know. I was looking around and see if you have just kind of dropped your channel, even though I might have said your channel before it doesn't matter I will repeat it so in that way if I have any new subscribers come in they can go check your channel I know APG Jamie you guys can go check her channel she is such an amazing youtuber go check her channel she's the one that wrote me the little letter now let's see um, if I can understand the most of the handwriting of my friends sometimes it's takes me a moment to understand the writing so it says it says here that she's doing activities at home with the boys that is wonderful you have to enjoy family that is the best thing oh my god I can wait till the summer uh, Sandra so I can get to, to by the summer I should be doing much much better mm, no please I break that I do and I can enjoy uh, uh, my family that's coming to see me so I'm glad that this surgery went now 
rather now than in the summer. Even though it's like, very painful, and it's not the best of the best feeling because you guys see me here all happy and being making these silly faces and whatnot, but it's not easy. Only those that have gone through this surgery, where you either lost one breast or both breasts, you would understand where I'm coming from. How painful that is and I pray to God I hope I make friends like that here in YouTube I thought I had a bruise or something but anyways let's continue with our friend's letter it says um, let's see I won't write again till Wednesday morning what do you do on Tuesdays oh my darling before the surgery and all that stuff I used to be able to do things on Monday Tuesday Wednesday all the way through Sunday but on Tuesdays I normally will get up and pray read my Bible or like watch Christian movies or watch my youtubers all of you guys I do take the time to watch my youtubers uh, I have connections I, I I those that write to me I want to be honest with you those that write to me and those that leave comments those are the ones that I watch their YouTube channel the most because it's like we built this relationship even though you guys are like from far away oh my god I get letters from Texas that's where that's where my daughter lives that's amazing you guys can go see my daughter or you guys are closer to her than me but normally on Tuesdays I can go out it depends uh, before the surgery I used to go out and get some fresh air from the dogs I love going outside where they have animals like the dogs and gooses and things and we go my husband and I to the store and we buy bread dollar store usually and feed them I enjoy nature I enjoy going out uh, it doesn't ha necessarily have to be on Tuesday uh, let's see uh, what else my beautiful friend is asking me on Wednesday I also will wash clothes and tidy up the boys room yes like when everything before the surgery was nice and well oh my god like gee this letter is so like it kind of brings a little bit of tear to my eyes because I'm sitting here and don't feel bad Sandra that you asking me these questions because it's okay I love I love when people ask me questions I really love when people ask me questions and I will answer it the best I can hopefully I am answered Hopefully, I'm answering, Sandra, your questions. But normally, uh, they call me the Energizer, the Energizer Rabbit. I get in trouble all the time with my family, with my husband, with my mother-in-law, with everyone. Because I do not like to stay still. This surgery here kind of forced me... <laughs> to sit down and actually right now uh, I write a lot so basically I just asked my husband for my notebook and I just write and write and write basically what I write is like my doctor's visits my surgery experience uh, whatever I go out throughout the day whether it's good or bad I write it in my diary so if that will help answer the question but it like I say it doesn't have to be on Tuesday it could be any day of the week it depends on how I feel and if I am like how would I say uh, alert and up when I'm not tired I try to write as much as I can get it out of my system whether it's good or bad and it helps me a lot it helps me a lot because 
going through what I'm going through is not as easy. It's kind of difficult to go through, you know, my situation. So in that way, I don't get frustrated sitting here in this recliner all the time. At least I get to read these letters. Uh, that's why I ask you to write to me because because of you because of God and you guys I keep getting motivated to continue to go on with my life and I do have the support of like I say my husband my children uh, his family my family people from church but I love to connect with people from all around the world and and and, and hopefully you know motivate you guys as well as you motivating me i motivate you by saying you know what despite of what i'm going through i'm going to continue to smile and i want you guys to smile too despite of you going through something difficult you're going through a difficult time excuse me we both all the my 62 friends that are here in youtube we can all motivate each other and and i just i love reading these letters i really love reading these letters and i will forever as long as i have life i will cherish your mail and whatever you guys send me because i, I have my uh my uh scrapbook and that's where i'm going to keep all these beautiful letters and i'm just going to continue to like whenever i feel down or whatever I just pick them up and say wow look how beautiful this is and like you took the time to to write to me oh man that's so special that is so special let's see uh, okay she says your car is so pretty and thank you for all all the uh I can't understand that word. <laughs> Sorry. I will uh, save them for the next Christmas. Oh, okay. I don't even remember exactly everything I sent you, my good friend Sandra. Through I, through I will start Christmas craft early, so I am not uh, rushing last minute. Mm. Yeah, that's true. Well, my sweet friend, till we meet again, I color this page while I relax and I thought I use it to write. Okay, uh -huh. that's what I feel about. I did have, I did have a forward on my mail back in it okay so your letters reach me okay all right all right i'm glad that you uh rewrote uh your uh personal address so we can keep in touch sandra i promise we'll keep in touch just let me get well so in that way i can get up and get all my my, my uh supplies and and right back at you Oh, that is so sweet. I just, I love it. How she thought about using this page that she colored and then she wrote me a letter in the back. That's a great idea, you know. Smart, smart idea. You now she got me another little letter here. I don't know if I have any more questions. Oh, I should have read this one first. Dear Lucy, hi, how are you? I am doing okay here for now. Oh, you are too kind. Oh, thank you. See, that's what warms my heart up. You guys just, oh my goodness. You are so sweet too, Sandra. Thanks for your uh, compliments. Make me smile. Mm, that's what I'm here for to make everyone smile I want everybody to be happy uh, that is my main goal I don't like seeing 
people hurt or sad, I really know you I guess stay in touch with your will. We can be a pen friends. <laughs> sure will. And through here, through our YouTube channel. To you big kiss. Never worry about being late. You uh write when you can. Uh -huh. How are you feeling right now? Well, as I mentioned, you know, I went through this uh really hard unexpected surgery because I was expecting to, I was thinking chemo and it was going to be a very strong chemo but for some reason God said no chemo surgery the only thing that I'm praying about my friends and Sandra that you wrote me this letter and since you asked me this question I'm going to give you the answer uh, is my liver there are signs of cancer in my liver but they're very minimal but you know, we have the healer here, it's God. And also, I pray for my doctors and nurses that God will guide them and use the right resources, medications and stuff like that, for I can get well. I mean, God has the last word. He has the last word. So, for now, I'm just hanging in there. Uh, staying very positive, have a lot of faith in God, and that's uh, how I'm feeling right at this very moment, Sandra. Okay, I have watched your videos. Thank you for watching my videos because if you watch my videos, then you'll know about my happy mail, uh, you would know things about myself by asking questions. Um, and updates in, in my life and see where I go from here down the road five years from now okay I mean I'm just saying five years from now because of the simple fact that I can't predict my future my future is in God's hands <laughs> okay let's see I hope your new year is being kind to you God bless um, God, God's blessing is everywhere around us. Amen to that. I usually write in the early morning, but I want to be home all day tomorrow. I have, okay, that's why she did. I have activities outside the home with the boys. So I should, I should have read this one before the other one, but that's okay because you know we got it together as long as I just as long as I answer all these beautiful questions I'm okay thank you Sandra for asking questions and hopefully I answer these questions in this video this happy mail and I'm sorry that I didn't get this mail right before but because of the surgery I had to put it on home so I had already opened the mail as I mentioned before and look at these beautiful beautiful card handmade I, I i just i love when when people send me handmade cards i really i really appreciate them so much because you it that your time you it's your time you took your time to put this together and that to me is so valuable because i feel that's very very special on your behalf to do something like that so i already know this is from apg jamie right there it is on on the on this side here you can check her out in youtube apg jamie uh, that's the inside that's what she wrote and this is the back of it with a little window there window for lights Thank you, APG Jamie. Guys, go check her channel out. She's an amazing person. She is fun. And you'll love how she makes her videos. We've got all kind of uh, crafties there. You love it. You won't regret. Go check her channel out. And that's amazing. And thank you, Jamie, for your card. I will have it soon on my 
uh, scrapbook and I will look at them from time to time to remind myself of those beautiful words that you guys say to me and those questions and everything that's just totally something that will give me uh, something to do while I'm recuperating so thank you so much for the happy mail if I get any money uh, if I get any more excuse me happy mail I will share with you guys very soon thank you thank you so much I'll see you guys very soon bye bye